Imagine this, you're all tucked in bed ready to venture into the land of dreams, but alas, your knee pain decides to throw a party. Sound familiar? Welcome, dear listener, to the nocturnal conundrum that plagues many a dreamer, the vexing villainy of knee pain. There you are, your mind ready to embark on a journey into the realm of slumber, only to be rudely interrupted by the gnawing, throbbing discomfort in your knee. It's a common tale, one that resonates with far too many of us. Knee pain is no respecter of persons, afflicting the young athlete and the seasoned gardener alike. It's a widespread issue, with countless individuals across the globe wrestling with this uninvited nighttime guest. In fact, studies suggest that a staggering one in four adults may experience knee pain at some point in their lives. Now, the culprits behind this nuisance are many and varied. For some, it's the wear and tear of osteoarthritis that's to blame. Years of use can take a toll on those precious knee joints, leading to pain that seems to come alive in the quiet of the night. For others, it could be an injury, a remnant from a long-forgotten fall or twist. Perhaps it's a torn ligament, a sprained muscle, or just plain old inflammation that's keeping you from your much-needed rest. Then there are conditions like rheumatoid arthritis and gout that can turn your knees into a battleground, with pain as the primary weapon. And let's not forget about bursitis, the inflammation of the small, fluid-filled sacs that cushion your knee joints. This can turn every bend and flex into a painful ordeal, especially when you're trying to find that perfect sleeping position. So here you are with an unwanted nighttime guest. But fret not, we've got the secrets to show that knee pain the door. This is the beginning of your journey to reclaim the peaceful, restful nights you deserve. Buckle up, dear friends, as we delve into the world of nighttime knee relief secrets. Now before we can send this pain packing, we need to understand why it's crashing your sleep party in the first place. Picture this. You're all snuggled up in bed, ready for a good night's sleep, but your knee has other plans. It's like there's a tiny rock band jamming away in there, isn't it? Well, let's figure out who invited them. The first culprit, and probably the biggest party animal, is inflammation. During the day, your body is in motion, blood is flowing, and your knee is in its happy place. But at night, everything slows down, including your blood flow. This can lead to an accumulation of inflammatory substances around your knee joint, turning it into a mosh pit of discomfort. The second instigator is, ironically, a lack of movement. You see, your knee joint is a bit of a social butterfly. It thrives on activity. But when you're sleeping, it's like the party's over and everyone's left. This lack of movement can lead to stiffness and pain, especially if you have osteoarthritis or other degenerative joint diseases. And let's not forget the silent party crasher, stress. Yes, stress can also contribute to your nighttime knee pain. When you're stressed, your body produces hormones like cortisol that can increase inflammation and sensitivity to pain. So, if you've had a tough day, it's like your knee is bearing the brunt of it. Lastly, there's the elusive guest who always overstays their welcome, previous injury. If your knee has been injured in the past, even if it's been years, it can still cause you trouble. Scar tissue, misalignment, or just plain old wear and tear can make your knee more susceptible to pain. Aha, so that's why your knee decides to start a rock concert at night. Now let's look at how we can quieten the noise. All right, time to spill the beans. Let's dive into those nighttime knee relief secrets, shall we? First off, let's talk about the role of exercises. Yes, you heard that right. Exercises can help reduce knee pain. But wait, don't start doing jumping jacks just yet. We're talking about gentle, low-impact exercises designed to strengthen the muscles around your knee and increase flexibility. Think along the lines of leg raises or cycling on a stationary bike. It's like a spa day for your knee, but with a bit of sweat involved. Next up on the roster, we've got hot and cold therapy. This isn't about testing your tolerance to extreme temperatures, but rather about reducing inflammation and swelling. A warm bath or a heating pad can help relax tense muscles and improve blood flow, while a cold pack can numb the pain and reduce swelling. It's like having your own personal weather system, but for your knee. Another secret weapon in your arsenal could be over-the-counter pain relievers. These can help take the edge off the pain, making it easier for you to fall asleep. But remember, these should not be your first line of defense. Always consult your doctor before starting any medication. And don't forget about the power of positioning. A few strategic pillows can make all the difference. Placing a pillow between your knees or under your affected knee can help maintain proper alignment and reduce strain. It's like playing Tetris, but with pillows and your comfort at stake. Lastly, consider incorporating mindfulness techniques like deep breathing or meditation into your bedtime routine. 
These can help distract your mind from the pain and promote relaxation. It's like taking a mini vacation but without the travel expenses. Remember these aren't one-size-fits-all solutions. You might have to play around a bit to find what works best for you. Exercise for knee pain? You heard it right, folks. Now I know what you're thinking. You're imagining high-intensity workouts, sweat trickling down your forehead, your knees screaming in protest. But let's take a step back, shall we? We're not talking about running marathons here. Exercise in the context of knee pain is a lot gentler and decidedly more targeted. The focus is on building strength and flexibility around the knee to provide support and relief. It's like building a fortress around a castle, safeguarding it from potential harm. Consider the muscles around your knee, your quadriceps, hamstrings, and calf muscles. These are your body's natural knee defenders. When they are strong and flexible, they can effectively absorb the shock that would otherwise go straight to your knee joint. It's a little bit like having your own personal shock absorbers. Now the key here is balance. Strengthening exercises are crucial, yes, but so are flexibility exercises. Think of it like a well-choreographed dance where strength and flexibility move in harmony. Too much strength without flexibility can lead to stiffness. On the other hand, too much flexibility without strength can leave the knee vulnerable. And let's not forget about low-impact aerobic exercises. Activities like swimming, cycling, or even a leisurely walk in the park can work wonders. They increase blood flow, nourish your joints, and can help control weight. After all, less weight means less pressure on those knees. Remember though, it's not about doing as much as you can, as fast as you can. It's about consistency. Regular moderate exercise is the secret sauce to maintaining knee health. One last thing. While exercise is a powerful tool, it's not a magic bullet. It's important to listen to your body and respect its limits. Pain is a signal, not a challenge to overcome. No pain, no gain doesn't apply here. So get moving, but of course, always consult with a professional before starting a new exercise routine. Exercise is a friend, not a foe to those with knee pain. It's all about finding the right balance and the right routine. Your knees will thank you for it. You are what you eat, and your knee pain might just be a testament to that. Indeed, the food we consume can be a powerful ally in our fight against knee discomfort. We're not talking about magic potions or wonder foods here, but rather plain old everyday nutrition that can make a world of difference to your knees. You see, our bodies are incredibly complex machines, and like all machines, they function best when they are well-fueled. A healthy diet, rich in all the right nutrients, can help manage inflammation, which is often at the root of knee pain. Now let's talk specifics. We'll start with omega-3 fatty acids, the anti-inflammatory superstars. They're found in foods like fatty fish, walnuts, and flax seeds. Research suggests that these can help reduce inflammation and in turn, alleviate knee pain. Next up, we have fruits and vegetables, the champions of antioxidants. These colorful gems are rich in vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants, which can help to combat inflammation. Think berries, oranges, spinach, and broccoli. The more colorful your plate, the better it is for your knees. Then, there's the power of spices. Certain spices, like turmeric and ginger, are known for their anti-inflammatory properties. A dash of turmeric in your soup or a slice of ginger in your tea could be just what your knees need. And don't forget about whole grains. Foods like brown rice, oatmeal, and whole grain bread can help to maintain a healthy body weight, reducing the pressure on your knees. But remember, it's not just about what you eat, but also what you avoid. Processed foods, sugary drinks, and excessive alcohol can trigger inflammation, worsening your knee pain. So the next time you reach for a snack, remember, your knees are watching. It's time to shift from being a passive consumer to an active nurturer of your body. Because when it comes to knee pain, you've got the power to influence your own relief. It's all in your hands, or rather, on your plate. Well, folks, we've reached the end of this nighttime journey. A journey through the twists and turns of knee pain that's been keeping us from the sweet embrace of a good night's sleep. But, as with all journeys, the most important part isn't the destination, but what we've learned along the way. We've delved into the causes of nighttime knee pain unearthing the myriad of factors that can contribute to this unwelcome nocturnal guest. From arthritis to injury, we've seen that understanding the root cause is the first step towards finding relief. We've also discovered the pivotal role of exercise in managing knee pain. Gentle stretches and low-impact activities can strengthen the muscles around the knee, providing much-needed support to the joint. Remember, it's not about running a marathon, 
but about cultivating a routine that works for you and your body. Equally important, we've explored the role of diet in reducing inflammation and promoting overall joint health. Omega-3 fatty acids, lean proteins, and a rainbow of fruits and vegetables can fuel our bodies and help combat knee pain in the process. And let's not forget hydration. Water is the unsung hero in our quest for pain-free knees. But perhaps the most important takeaway is that there's no one-size-fits-all solution. Each of us is unique with our own set of circumstances, challenges, and needs. What works for one person may not work for another, so it's important to listen to your body and find the approach that works best for you. In the end, it's about more than just knee pain. It's about reclaiming our nights, reclaiming our sleep, and reclaiming our lives. It's about not letting pain keep us from the restful slumber we so desperately need and deserve. So tuck in, folks. Here's to a good night's sleep, free of knee pain. Until next time, sweet dreams.